hello hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel in this video i'm going to be showing you guys my relaxer routine i'm going to be relaxing my hair by myself at home so you guys i'm just i'm still carrying these two braids that i made at my workplace and if you check my hair you can see like two inches of new growth in my hair i last relaxed my hair in december 2022 so my hair is in need of a relaxer i just finished taking out my braids and i'm just going to go in with this comb right now and comb down my hair before doing anything to my hair i'm sure that you can see the relaxed part of my hair is shining brown i don't know why that is but then the, the new growth is, is still black so i usually do this too where i take the length of my hair with my face and then i'm just going to go ahead and show you guys the new growth can you just imagine it's like two inches of new hair that i have to relax and it's spinning me it's spinning me now so that is the reason why i'm trying to relax my hair what other better relaxer to use than olive oil? Strong, silky, straight. I promise, I'm not the ambassador, I promise. But my, I have a very stubborn hair, so this is the only relaxer that actually works for my hair. This relaxer comes in sachets in the carton. So I'm just going to be using this one and I have to mix the two together to be able to get the relaxer that I want. It also comes with a spatula and one glove inside. I'm just going to go ahead and mix the relaxer and the activator really well. Like you need to make sure you mix it very very well to be able to get this kind of consistency. So to start up my hair prep, I'm just going to go in with this oil. I was supposed to use a hair cream, but my number has forgot. So I just have to go in with this Cousin's baby oil, and I need it to protect my edges and my hairline because the chemical can get, you know, into on your skin. Yeah. I also make sure to get it on my ears because my ear is very close to my hair so the relaxer can also get on my ear so I make sure to cover my ear really well I also go ahead to put some on my hands because I know the relaxer is definitely going to touch my hands so I'm just going to go ahead and comb back my hair again to make sure I don't have any knots in my hair then I'm going to make partitions I'm going to divide my hair into three so I can walk by sections I really don't know why I'm suffering myself by using this big ass comb to partition my hair when I have a small comb by my side but my brain didn't <laughs> oh my god my So I'm just going to go ahead and braid the three sections so it can be easier for me to work with.
next up i'm going to wear my gloves i really don't know why they're putting only one glove in the box but i'm just going to use this one because this is the hand i'm going to be using to take the relaxer from the cup and into my hair for the application i'm going to be starting off with my front hair because i do not have a full length mirror so i have to use my phone screen to you know act as a mirror i'm just going to gently put the relaxer in my hair you see this is the reason why you need to put all your or hair cream in front of your hair before you start relaxing your hair okay so i'm just going to go ahead and start with this section And I'm using my hand to partition the hair because I only want the relaxer in like two inches of my hair of the new growth you get. I know it looks messy, it looks messy, but like trust the process, okay? As you can see, I'm taking it slow because my hair takes long to process, so I'm not even in, air, in any rush because I have a very stubborn hair. But if you're someone that has a light hair or a weak hair be sure to fasten up your pace okay don't be like me now i'm trying to saturate and massage the relaxer into my hair and then i'm just going to go ahead and you know lock it in and then move on to another section of the hair If you notice I didn't really touch my front hair because it processes faster so don't do that to your hair just go ahead and move on to the sections so you partition and then you apply you're going to try to do this consistently and that thing is relax I can get everywhere so you need to be very very careful I'm just going to go ahead and apply relaxer on the places I missed before my edges for example because your edges processes faster than the other parts of your hair so you need to make sure you apply relaxer on the place last as you can see I'm still trying to massage the relaxer into my hair in case in case if I missed like some places in the hair so the relaxer will get to those parts and saturate the whole hair The relaxer was still remaining so I was trying to make sure I put everything in my hair and I was trying to make sure I, I only put relaxer in my new growth of hair and the gloves <laughs> oh my god so I'm just going to leave my hair for 10 minutes and then I'm going to go to roll and rinse now when it comes to rinsing shampooing and conditioning your hair you need to first of all make sure that you get all the products out of your hair you need to be patient with this because relaxer takes a while to you know wash out of your hair time for shampoo for this process i do wash my hair with the, with the shampoo for like three to four times to make sure all the relaxer in my hair is gone and i like the way this shampoo is made because if your if there's still relaxer in your hair it will shine pink like the foam will be pink 
but if there's no more relaxer in your hair the foam will be white so i really love how this olive oil shampoo is made i also make sure not to scratch my hair while washing because your scalp is sensitive at this point and any little thing can just injure you okay and then i'm going to go in with my mega growth deep conditioner I'm going to go in with a generous amount of deep conditioner and I'm going to go ahead and apply that to all of my hair. At this point, I'm just going to go in with my big comb and comb through my hair to make sure the product gets to all parts of my hair because I need my hair to be healthy. I need my hair to be healthy because my hair has been through it. So your fave forgot to buy a wig cap and we're going to go ahead and use a nylon as a wig cap for today. We've locked the hair in so I'm just going to leave it on for 5 minutes and then we're going to go ahead and rinse out the clip conditioner from the hair. yeah 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 so this is what i'm looking like okay. <laughs> so i'm just going to go ahead and loosen this towel and then try to comb up my hair all right so i'm just going to go ahead and comb out the hair and i'm going to allow it to air dry because First of all, there's no light. There's no light to use the hair dryer to dry my hair. Nigeria needs to fix up a bag. My hair is not dried a bit. I'm just trying to show you guys what my hair looks like relaxed, okay? And I made some mistakes at the back because if you, if you look at the back, you see these two edges of my hair that relaxed I didn't get to, alright? so be mindful of that when you are relaxing your own hair you can now go ahead and style your hair in whatever way you want yes this is how i styled mine all right and yeah guys that is all for this video i know you enjoyed this video and i also enjoyed filming for you guys i will see you guys in my very next video Mwah. bye